digloid.com. Hey, just for kicks, let's check out the new um, ODBC Expr uh, Express 1M, uh, Express 2M, oh heck, Express 1M2 takes an M PCIe M.2 SSD internally. I'm going to, I've already converted one of them to a soft rate format, the EM1 8 terabyte, and I'm going to convert the other one here. Uh, from uh, disk utility to soft raid. I'm doing that so I can stripe them. I'm, I'm just curious. These things are amazingly fast on the order of <clears throat> three and a half gigs a second. So let's let's um let's uh, let's erase these guys and uh, and then make a stripe out of them and see what we can get. Uh, that's pretty cool. So let's uh, initialize. Which will, um, oh, safeguard enabled. Okay, disabled. Great feature of soft raid. I'll disable safeguard. Dis, uh, disable safeguard on those two guys. All right, grab these guys and say initialize. Initialize. These are connected to my uh, 2023 Mac Pro M2 Ultra. Uh, soft raid showing us what it's doing here is it initializes these guys, it wipes out all data. Uh, trims enabled on them. So let's take a new volume and uh, how about uh, RAID 0? That's a stripe. We should double our size. We'll make it um, 8 terabytes. That's 4 terabytes from each. And what name should we give it? Like uh, I'm just going to call it uh, stripe. Maybe. Or how about zebra? Great. Uh, stripe unit size, da 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 da. All right, here we go. Zebra is ready to use, but let's do one thing, which you should do before testing anything. When you go into, um, you want to go into Siri and Spotlight, uh, and you want to go to Spotlight Privacy, and you want to make sure any new drive. Where'd the system put this thing? This is kind of annoying. I've got double screens, which is kind of a hassle. Okay, thank you Apple for making things confusing. <laughs> Where did Zebra go? Oh, there's Zebra. Okay, so drag Zebra in. Done. Okay, now we can test without worrying about that. So uh, we're done with soft trade for that, but let's go into um, Terminal and we're going to use a program called Disk Tester, a Java version, uh, part of D Digiloid Tools, my stuff. And uh, we're going to use the fill command here. So, DJ fill zebra. And let's see what we've got. All right, so we're hitting 5.3 gigabytes per second on this striped pair of o OWC Express 1M2 plugged into the Mac Pro. That's not bad. They're a bit mismatched drives. One's an eight and one's a four, so that's not our ideal scenario. Okay, so 5.3 gigabytes a second. Let's uh, do another test, um, sequential test, which will read and write, and we can see it a little, a little faster. Okay, so we're writing at 5.3 gigabytes a second, and we're reading at 6.3 gigabytes a second. Not bad. Uh, I'm not necessarily recommending this. I think you're better off probably with a ODBC Thunderblade. But if you need a super fast uh, striped RAID for your Mac Pro or something that has enough ports on it, it's got eight of them on a Mac Pro or Mac Studio on the M2 Ultra at least, then you could scarf two of those ports or two of these things and get six gigs a second. Of course, the internal SSD will do that too, but if you're full or just need a big scratch disk, this should get the job done. Looking back, you can see that um, Zebra here in soft rate is, um, you can see it's tied to these two um, Express 1 M2s, which are on the uh, PCI bus via USB 4, and that's what's giving us this terrific speed. So 5.3 and 6.2 gigabytes a second, not bad. Um, let's, uh, an, an integrity checker, we could uh, update. Let's do, uh, do cryptographic hashes. Let's do that too. Update Zebra. 135 gigabytes. It's hitting 6 gigs a second. 
doing the hashes. Um, that's not bad. That's real world throughput. Something I do every day on something or other. Six gigs a second, I'll take any day. There we go. It found them all. All right, let's let's verify. Let's verify those files. They might still be in the cache. We'll see here. Maybe not. Yeah, it didn't get cached apparently. Otherwise, it could hit like 20 gigs a second. Um, anyway, so uh, we've got this uh, striped RAID pair here, and uh, super fast. This is kind of a cheap way to get ultra high performance PCI cards better if you have a Mac Pro, but just to show it can be done. Uh, why not have a little fun with it here? And again, I don't really recommend this. I, I think you're better off with an OWC Thunderblade, but if you need twice the speed externally, then either RAID 2 Thunderblades or, or a RAID um, 2 of these Express 1M2s. They certainly have the juice to, to get the job done.